today we're going to take a look at the crush resistant horizontal LED strobe light set. Now this is a crush resistant LED strobe light set that will feature two multi-directional strobes that automatically turn on when in the horizontal position. And these lights can act as a warning beacon when you're installed on the edge of a lift gate or a tailgate. And these lights can also be wired to an auxiliary switch which we sell separately if you want to manually actuate them for non-moving applications like the corners of dump trucks or service bodies. They have a made of a durable 12 gauge 304 stainless steel crush resistant housing and then the lens over the LEDs is a polycarbonate lens. It is for two and they have eight LEDs in each one multi-directional strobes with a gyroscopic on and off sensor but based, what that basically does is when this light is in the horizontal position the light will activate and come on and when it's in the vertical position it will automatically go off. I am going to hook this up to some 12 volt power just to show you how that works. They do use LEDs which make great replacements for incandescent lights. They last about 50 times longer and they're more efficient because they provide brighter light with less power output and of course they use no bulbs to replace so there's no brittle filaments. These strobe lights do come in pairs so that they can be wired for sync or alternating patterns. Comes with one M host light and one S sub light and they are marked on here M and S. Basically the host light is the main light that you hook up and then you can host up to three S or sub lights with one host light. This kit happens to come with one of each. Now both of these will feature a 35 foot long wire lead, the durable stainless steel housing, and the rubber gasket on it when you install it to seal it. The kit includes all the stainless steel mounting hardware, six extra wiring grommets, and backing plates for each light, and a nice set of detailed instructions. They are a nice silver housing have the clear lens with amber LEDs, again their surface mount design, and their wiring on the other end you can see is a blunt cut wiring connection to connect to power. Does have, again have eight diodes per light, the wattage is 1.2 watts, 12 volts, amperage is 0.1 amp at 12 volts. Just want to give you the measurements on one of these. Width on them is right at about two and a quarter inches, and by about two and a half inches, and overall height on them is right about five eighths of an inch. So what I'm going to do now is hook these up. Well, I'm going to hook this one up. It'll have three wires. You can see there's a red wire and a black wire. The red is your power wire. The black is your ground. There is a white wire and they do have a tag on it. You do not want to connect power to the white wire. The white wire is used to connect it to the sub lights to be able to uh, have it perform in either a sync mode or an alternating pattern. So what I'm going to do is show you we're going to hook up the ground wire and we'll hook up the power wire and then what I'm going to show you is we're going to keep this in the horizontal position. We'll go ahead and turn on the power and you can see it in the horizontal position. It's automatically flashing. Go ahead and turn off the overhead lights. It's a good bright alternating flash. And then if you notice this is what I'm going to do is turn back on the overhead lights. If you notice as it goes up in the vertical position, it automatically shuts off. Again, as it goes down in the horizontal, it automatically comes on, raises up vertical position, automatically goes off. And as I mentioned, this white wire right here, if you connect it over to here and supply power to that, then you can have these work together. And it will take up to three of those S sublights. Go ahead and turn off the power. We'll disconnect it. But that should do it for the review on the crush-resistant horizontal LED strobe light set.